so I said before, I'm just going to do small houses, but I just got a little bit of inspiration and I wanted to try something. I might not put this out, but yeah, I wanted to make a water um, kind of a boathouse. So instead of your typical boathouses I've seen on YouTube, um, and it's like a boat and a house, this is where you can kind of pull up your boats and a proper boathouse. Do you know what I mean? Um, so yeah. I've got this on. I have no clue at the area because I'm just freestyling this. I've just kind of put this down. I would say 60 by 60 huge area by the seafront. I would say maybe have this off the water about five or something like that. Just a straight line up there. And I'm just going to work at it really. Maybe some jetties at the side and uh, see where I go from there. Um, so I'm using some of the pillared quartz. And this is going to be the birch planks and pillar quartz there i'm going to use some maybe some polished diorite for the the door maybe some of the stone brick stairs smooth quartz and maybe a lot of end rods because i kind of want to use those as kind of like a railing so if you're in survival it's probably not for survival people really but you know so we'll start off with a pillar quartz like that three across here and then another now maybe i want to go one two three four five six seven well not maybe definitely so seven gap there and then one behind there one behind there and then one two three and then one now i'm going to do one part and then maybe just repeat it for world edit for the other half so it doesn't take hours um but i'm going to do the front here the front and the back are probably going to be exactly the same i'm going to have a railing going round so this from the water from this sorry one two three four five six i think maybe six high one two three four five six and across like this and then i'm going to double this up because i'm going to put the door behind this and uh, i'm using the faithful 64 texture pack so yeah so yeah i'm going to see if it turns out all right hopefully it does um i've got some kind of little ideas of what i want to do um, I don't want to get these into the ground because I kind of want it floating. I'm going to maybe put some jetties around it. Um, but yeah, so what I thought is polished diorite like this. And this could be kind of the garage door or whatever. So have the windows like that. And then maybe some smooth stone slab. And yeah, put some windows in. And that's kind of like the garage into it. So it's still kind of the right height that you could probably fit a boat in or something if you wanted to build like a, a bigger better boat you could probably do that um i've got a boat tutorial on my channel it's like a proper speed boat so it probably wouldn't fit underneath there so you probably have to bring that back up but i was thinking maybe we can kind of like have this so it kind of looks like it's been pulled in but i'll do that at a later date when we're working on the inside of it so that for now i think i'm just gonna bring it up to the same height as this and this kind of i want it to kind of go over the top of this and then i might double thickness it again so bring this out more so obviously that would be down to here and uh, yeah i just think would that look all right as a boat in thing maybe it's maybe it's maybe it's not i don't know but yeah i'm have, making sure the grains all go in the same way and i might double up here as well yeah i'll put this underneath here and maybe something like I could get some or well, i could get the jetty to connect to these parts which is probably wise now this at the side here, I'm going to bring this up to the same height as everything else. Same with this as well. So this is going to come up to the same height. But not that one. I might put like a stair on it there. So kind of like that. Uh, so sorry if it's like uh, yeah, a bit all over the place. Because I'm kind of just thinking on the fly here. Uh, I wasn't really going to do tutorial. But um, I was going to just build this in my spare time. But I thought, you know, I might as well show my building process i guess um and then someone could get something from it i guess so it's one higher than that um maybe we could just put those so they're aiming up at least like that and uh maybe because of that there 
we could maybe put it in the middle. I apologise. But you can obviously keep it wherever you like, but I just feel it would just be better to have it in the middle, I guess. And then from the inside, and trying to think for the inside and the outside, it, so it kind of looks good both ways. Because um, I was feeling optimistic when I started this. So I was thinking, I'll do all the inside as well, and all the jetties on the inside, so making that look cool. So yeah, might do that. So yeah, so we got that, and then I'm going to bring this up to the same height as well. So this is the middle piece, and basically what we've done here is going to re be repeated there. So this is kind of like to there. So this piece here would be this one, if you get my gist. So we just, I could probably copy and paste it just straight over there, which should be better. But I guess I could just still do it here and I can just copy and paste the back and make it easier. So three here, bringing it to the top. And then this going up there. Oh no, uh, no, this one, sorry, is going to here. So like that, I want to make sure they're all pointing down just because I'm just funny like that. I have no idea. So this is not not that high it's one two three four five six and across like that and then we can double it up again just like we've done at the other side so yeah hopefully it'll be all right i'm kind of um thinking we could have a huge balcony going all the way around which might be quite cool um, with the end rod, so it's kind of experimenting experimenting with what might work. This is going to go over the top and then obviously three Might go a bit higher with this as well and then this I Need to figure out what the sides will look like, but yeah, just um, exactly the same as the other side so this and uh, this So um, let's get some stone brick for this. See how it's looking. Right. Looking nice. Yeah, we forgot this bit, so put this on here as well. Make sure I'm going under. Like that. Now, how high do you think we should do it, guys? How high? Even though you can't speak to me. But you can shout through the screen. You never know. I might hear you. Let's do it up another level. And obviously bring these up a bit more. It's going to be a huge blinking boathouse. Um, right, okay, so, hmm, maybe if we do this at the same level here, so this would probably make life a little bit easier. Let's do it from here first, and then obviously that's going to be around there, and then maybe, let me get some blocks of the, I might get smooth, smooth, Smooth quartz. Put a block there and that. Um, maybe one more actually. So like that and then the block. So it's kind of like that and then yeah, same here as well. Because we'll be doubling up there. So one on there and of course one on here. So the best way I just go like this. And then just fill the rest. It just take the the things out. Take these funny patterns out, and then just replace them with blocks. Just makes it a little bit faster for me, anyway. But you can do it whichever way you choose to do it. Um, and then here as well. Are we level? Are we level? There we go. And then get to my blocks and fill it in. And then we can kind of figure out what we're gonna do. I'm, oh yeah, I'm gonna do it this side as well. So yeah. Okay, so we've got that. Um, yes, yes. Let me have a look here. Um, sorry if I'm not just straight away getting it all. Just kind of going with the flow, man. Just going with the flow. And I'm gonna get some quartz slabs here. I'm gonna fill all that in. I'm going to fill it across here as well. 
and across here so that will be to there and then obviously it will continue on straight across here as well so we can kind of walk across all this bit would three be enough i think maybe four might be better and then we can have our railings so this i'll do this first making sure it's all locking into place and then we can work on the next bit so fill all this in i just need to check if it's not too kind of low yeah i think that that works good should work perfectly fine i think right so we've got that and then we layer it again so just do another full layer across and um, that means when we're putting our actual blocks on it should work a bit better so i'm going to use the pillared quartz obviously definitely one there and one here and i kind of need to make it so it's kind of like they're all equal so it doesn't look stupid so one two three maybe one one two three one one two three gaps one same at this side because when we meet in the middle it might be different so it would look less funny one two three and then one one two three and then one same here one two three and then one and then one two three one one two three gaps one and then the middle is there which is four so you see what i mean but it doesn't look as funny because it's dead center in the middle so that's all right so now we can get these bits here which is the end rods just sticking up like this i just thought it'd make a good railing and i haven't really seen anybody do it um do you know for modern builds so i guess this is inspiration in itself um yeah let's put another one there so kind of like same here as well so one two three and then our pillared quartz and then maybe this across here um yeah just a kind of a half slab with the quartz on top of each one of these and then we can use the trap doors of the iron to just go across and it just makes like a really cool railing which I've, I haven't seen anybody do, do before I guess you could do it with carpet as well to make it even thinner but I kind of uh, so yeah if you're, you're doing it in survival and you kind of so much iron isn't it really uh, you could do it with carpet I'll show you what it'll look like with carpet um, you don't need any string which is a good thing about it but I don't know how easy or hard it is to get end rods so I guess that's with the carpet and that's with that i just think it looks a bit better with maybe a bit more thickness but it's the carpet's just as good anyway i guess there we go so something like that it's just it looks mint i think it's got a really good look to it um let's see for here i kind of feel like this would benefit from maybe having this as that across there kind of enclosed in like this and just having like a little bit here do you know what I mean um, maybe three and then we could just these could actually go into the ground then and then we can put some normal railings on maybe I don't know I'm just kind of going with it for now um, but something like that so we can kind of walk through here it's um i'll need to count that for you guys anyway so yeah um maybe kind of like this is kind of a, an entrance of some form um get some bushes at the side here could even use some end rod bushes really um but i think something like this i could put some bushes on there maybe 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 something like that yeah i guess and then um for this as well instead of using those end rods just to make it kind of could do this make it a bit more like glassy 
<laughs> a bit more glassy, you know, like that. Kind of looks cool. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Could maybe even put a window here, but um, kind of feel like it would need. Would you need this? Would you need this? I don't know. Maybe, uh, I don't know if this would work though with these birch trap doors. Yeah, it kind of looks silly. Unless it's one, maybe. That looks a little less silly, but nah. I mean, you guess. I guess you could play around with kind of like different things. Like maybe you could take them away and add grooves in it by adding stairs. So like the middle platform bit is kind of yeah, adding detail with stairs, I guess. Something like that. Kind of looks nice. I kind of like it. Um, so I'm going to go with that. Um, I'm going to put this across here and this side as well. And then probably add some bush in that just to make it nice. Yeah, I kind of wanted to make this really quite fancy. So, yeah. Um, let's see. Maybe, just maybe. Um, I could even get some of that. I don't know if it would work now. Maybe some of this will see what looks better by looking at each side. Yeah, I just think that adds a lot more to it, doesn't it? Kind of thing. I don't know if you guys agree, but <laughs> I'll agree with myself, you know. Um, and underneath here there as well. So it kind of looks like it comes through there and it's kind of uh, supporting it. Same with here as well, we can do that. So it kind of looks good, like it's going through. So it's going through to the other side, that's clicking in. Boom, looking good. Um, so we've got that so far. That's gonna go around it. Yes, we could, um, I'm gonna copy and paste this maybe. After I've probably counted this out for you guys, it'll probably be a bit better. So this is gonna be one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, and then place one of them. So like that. And then I just want to fill this to here. Same at the other side as well. So count it all the way across and bring this up to have our birch planks from obviously this middle piece just as those kind of join in and bring it across so that's to that side and then exactly the same copy what we've done here at the other side so to do that you just make sure that this post is that post do you get me so that would be one out from there so this post and then obviously that would be out by one so I'm gonna show you how to do it in world edit and then uh, yeah I'm gonna have to go out actually I need to make sure I'm level with that so level with that and then out by one maybe and then I'm gonna make sure I'm ahead of this here and then I can go up into the sky making sure I am higher than that and then I can select it with my world edit tool select with the left and then remove all that because I don't want to be copying all that and then I've got to fly to the other side and I want it copied just about here, level with this. In fact, it'll have to be one back because we want to get that in. So it needs to be here, down into the ground, making sure we're picking up all of this stuff underneath the ground, even those, but I can always sort those out. 
That's probably going to bring some water with it. So I'm probably... Minus double to you? I don't know. I'll just take it with me anyway. We'll see how this one fares. And then... We've got to find the exact middle. So the exact middle would be where this birch is here. And that would be standing there. So we go slash slash copy. And then stand on this piece in the middle. Moment of truth slash slash paste. Oh, oh, oh yeah, I forgot. Slash slash undo if you make a mistake. So we've got to do slash slash rotate. Row, that's not how you spell rotate. Rotate 180 degrees, so just 180, and then slash slash paste. Boom. Did that work? That worked. It worked, but it took all the water with it, which, um, I'm cool with that anyway. I can just fill it all in. So I could just go like this. I could go, um, select the dirt there, select that, and then just pretty much take out the bottom of everything, really. <laughs> take, and then just do it to here, maybe. Slash slash set grass under slash block. So that's done the first layer. And then I can just kind of work around it. Because this is probably, I don't want to take out kind of the underneath bit of it. Because that will probably take out all this anyway. So yeah, just got to get this bit in and get it past to this point. And then I can just fill all that in. Fill all this in as well. So we just have to do it bit by bit. But yeah. I'd usually do this off camera. But yeah. It is what it is. So I've done that bit, piece. I'll do this piece as well. And we're not taking out everything. And then I'm going to start from here. All the way to this other side here. And maybe select it there fills all that in and then I can do it from here making sure I don't go past this point so it'd be to here and yeah from here to here or something there we go can remove some of that back and of course yeah I forgot I've got to fill in this bit but I kind of uh, I'm probably gonna replace this with a block um, anyway but just for now just to make things life a little bit easier, I'm just going to fill it in with the grass. Okay, so yeah, that is where that is. Hopefully it's all level. I've got that. Um, kind of, I could probably remove this bit because it is the back of the build. So I can make it a little bit different. Obviously this is not going into the water anymore. So we can leave the floor, but um, maybe not the other bit. We could maybe have a hut going over the top of this bit, maybe. I think that might be quite cool, making sure. One, two, three on the fourth one. Maybe something like that, going over the top of where we've got this. And it's just kind of like an exit, I guess. And then, yeah. So it's kind of like the back of the building. Maybe we could store stuff in here or something. Just so it's a little bit different from the front, I guess. Um, maybe get some pillars to support it. And, um, yeah. Could maybe put it up even more so it's kind of like... A, kind of like this. So yeah, I could probably bring the pillars in there and it make it look a little bit better, maybe. I like that, yeah. So yeah, like that's the kind of back exit. I kind of maybe want to, one, two, three, four. Get this in. And yeah. Fill all this in by three and then obviously these sides as well so it'd be a five by five just going straight through the middle 
Um, obviously, I forgot to show you that bit. But yeah, you can just one, two, three, four, five. Just a five by five strip going all the way through the middle like that. And then obviously one, let's say one, two, three, four, like that, I think, yeah. And then I can just go and fill that all the way across as well. Slash I set five over two, maybe. Yeah. So like that. So that could be our back jetty. And then we'll do it from here as well. So this is kind of the inside walls. And because it kind of stops there, we could have another one here. So we can make this even thicker. So obviously this would be the dividing wall in the middle. So just to kind of imagine you've got this here for now, just splitting it up from that one to this one. I'm obviously going to make it so you can enter into both garages in the both ways, but just to make it easy. Um, so yeah, like that, you'd have one, two, three off the end here. And these are going to be one, two, three kind of gaps. So in the middles, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five, obviously, because this one's going to be a wall anyway. So that's going to be four across there, three across there with the one, three, one, and then obviously going from here and doing exactly the same on this side. So here to here, it's probably a bit more of an advanced tutorial, this one because I'm using a little bit of world edit you're gonna have to uh, ask someone for help if you're really struggling with this one um, but yeah so yes yeah, I mean like that I think it's all right Um I kind of feel like um, it needs to be raised up a little bit so maybe we could I kind of feel like we could use this stone because usually it's got like a trim around the edges so maybe like a would a trim be better there or maybe a bit higher here like this and just kind of following the inside like this and then obviously we're going to have to do a ladder at some point maybe if we put another one here we can get a ladder kind of coming out from there or something at both sides depending how far it goes down like that get some ladders coming out either side there and do the same at this side as well so starting from this point with the stone slab and uh, yeah so this is where the kind of boats pull up um, so about here so two off there uh, so that would be the ladder and the other one here I don't know if you can actually put ladders in what, but I might as well try. One, two, three. Yeah, something like that. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So yeah, those are our ladders coming into the place. And maybe, just maybe, probably best to have a gap here. So that's how we can get through one two maybe a, a three high doorway there so that's how we'll get through there same here obviously one two three there and making sure we have got our doorways to get through so you can get from this side to this side maybe you could do another one here so that would go up one two three one two three and same three doorway like that and then maybe we could go across the top here of it all for this one and this one and these are kind of like main supports of what would be this kind of build maybe we could do some white supports going from here to here as well because we've got those logs there so it kind of makes a bit more sense like that um, like that is fine there yeah I'm gonna bring these walls up and just fill that wall in plain 
to fill that wall up and then same with this one like this like that so when you're walking around I kind of feel like it should be glass as well so maybe do an extra one either side and then just kind of just the one layer of glass I don't think it should be full glass and maybe some of this across the top as something different maybe we could do it across the top here as well it probably make more sense to actually make the door even higher and then just that across there so it kind of matches with the, the other side maybe maybe we could do that as well um, bring that down and same for this one as well and just maybe let's see what it looks like yeah I guess I'm, I can live with that and then I'm gonna fill all this in because this is where we're gonna have our actual house on top because this is kind of like the garage of the boathouse and then I want in like maybe a cool sort of house I might actually plan the house out but I kind of knew I wanted this as kind of like the base and then a house on top so go from here to here and fill all this in making sure I don't ruin those lines we've already got so one from here to here gonna have to place a block for it and like that and yet so this would be probably the best way to do it is probably just bring this to join onto here and then we can always do the um, other stuff later I think I'm gonna have a rest from this so I've got fresh eyes on it um, but I kind of just, while I had the motivation, I kind of wanted to get it done, get it out of the way. And I do kind of want some stairways coming up here to kind of connect onto it. So cause otherwise you won't be able to get up, um, which is not good. So I'm going to bring this across here as well. So yeah, maybe some fancy stairways of some form. Might need to plan the stairways so they look all right. Um, and plan how I kind of want these side pieces to look as well but yeah so far so good underneath here let's see can we kind of have some rafters going from this side to this side maybe like this and uh, kind of feel like we need to put at least some lanterns in for now just to light the place up because it is pretty damn dark. So, I don't know how many gaps, just kind of two gaps, I guess. And then two gaps on this side, two gaps on that, and then we've got two gaps. Yeah, perfect. I can uh, add a little bit more to it later, but for now, I think that should be alright. So, one. I don't know if this works, but yeah. Two gaps there, two gaps there. It's going to annoy me if I don't do it properly. And then just two in there, actually, I guess. So we've got that. I'm going to put those railings across there. So obviously I'm going to do that at the other side. We've got the middle in there. Just so we've got some light in here, I guess. And then we can work on... I don't know, maybe putting some cool stuff around the place. It kind of makes it feel like it's working a bit better. It's actually meaningful, like it's got a purpose. Not like my life at the moment. <laughs> Molly Jackie, my life's got loads of purpose. Right, I'm going to get wait, that from there, actually. It's going to bug me otherwise. So two, then we can have two gaps and I don't have that silly one in the middle. Um, two gaps, two gaps, two gaps, I know, that one's not necessary, boom, yes, so, so far so good, there is a, a creeper in my, in my birdhouse, 
What are you doing? What are you doing, my sir? Um, obviously, this wall will be closed, so we might as well put this on here. Just one. In fact, we'll go like this, because this is definitely going to happen anyway. So like that, like archway. And then maybe we would have something like this going round the whole thing. So it kind of doesn't look so plain on the roof because you don't want a really plain roof. You kind of want some detail so it kind of comes alive a bit better. A lot of people neglect the roofs when they shouldn't. Not it. Right. And this to here, exactly the same. Just straight across here. Wait. Yeah, there. And then, yeah, I'm just going to call it a day for now. Because it's late at night here. But yeah, I just kind of wanted to get this bit done at least. And then tomorrow, see it with fresh eyes. Obviously, you guys will be able to tell that it's the next day. Well, I kind of, you'll see a little skip. I'm like, hi guys, I'm almost addicted here. I'm awake. I've had a coffee. I'm feeling great. So, I've got that. Um, anything else we could add while we're here? Let's see. Hmm. I think for now, that's all right. I kind of wanted to do the interior and exterior as well, so people would be like, wow, it's, it's like a cool boat, a proper cool boathouse. Um, but yeah, I guess for now, while I live, you guys, I'm going to stick a boat in here. There's a boat here. A boat here. Just a, a boat's just arriving. But obviously you can make like a proper boat. I'll put it down in the description. I've made a proper boat. It should fit in there. It should. If it doesn't, just make it look like it's kind of ready to go in or something. Like that would be going up. And you could have kind of like this. You can actually take this off. If you wanted to make it look like the garage door's actually opening. Just bring it to maybe that second light there and then so how many would it be actually they probably make more sense one two, one two three four and it would be closed so yeah four there so you can remove that one two three four have that across there so I'm getting inspired again I should probably go but um, yeah Chains and now we've got chains, it'd be pretty awesome actually. Um, railings like this, and then maybe a chain kind of like that. Does that look alright? You can make it look like it's probably, it might actually look better with a stair actually. Do we have direct stairs though? That is a question. Yeah. Obviously we can't do it where the window is, but it kinda looks like it's it's bending in, so yeah. Do something like that, so it kinda looks like it's well kind of clouding. And then Yeah, do it this side and I'm gonna do it the other side as well. Wait, I need the chain. Something like that. I used to actually fit garages for a living. <laughs> well, that and window fitting and roofing. Something you don't know about me. There you go. I did that for years, actually. I hated it. <laughs> it was horrible. Outside in the freezing cold, 24-7, man. On a crappy pay. It was the worst. And I tried to become a tattoo artist. Actually did some bouncing. I was on the door for a while. Telling people, you can't come in, mate. You're too drunk. All right. So, yeah, just come in. I'm not bothered. All right. So, yeah. There you go. And then I became a YouTuber. How about that? Right. This needs to actually go more. And now I'm probably going to have to wear... I don't know. 
probably have to go on the streets or something <laughs> and live on the streets because I am not getting a real job again. I'm telling you that. Tell you that for a laugh. I'm not even joking. Just straight up. Never again. But I decided to uh, invest a little bit in cryptocurrency. So if that fails, you know, if all else fails, I'll be on the street. But at least you've got some videos to remember me by. <laughs> So yeah, there you go. There's that at least. So yeah, we've got the doors there. That's four, that's four. Yes, right, I'm going to leave it there for now. And um, work on some other details and stuff. But I think so far, stick an awesome house in the middle there. We've got a wicked boathouse. Well, hopefully. Might not be. I don't know. So far, so good. So yeah. It's even like around here, you'd be like, yeah, yeah, it's happening feels like a proper you know I mean, a proper boat yard let's go for a let's go for a boat ride let's go for a boat ride uh, this, this, i need to focus on the tutorial right okay i'll catch you soon guys uh, so i'll see you in well you'll see me in about two seconds so yeah okay so it is the next day and i've put a foundation for the house so i kind of know what it's going to look like but kind of not at the same time so we're going to start in the middle here so we've got obviously this walkway here and then we've got these stripped lines going through so what we're going to do is we're going to place one here with obviously a one gap there and a one gap there and then either side we're going to leave a gap and then we're going to place one of these three across and then one like that same here one three one i'm going to focus on the front and then we can work on the back later so this is going to go up by one two three four five six maybe we'll go across and up like this i'm just going with the grain of the pillared quartz this is going to go up as well and across same with here this is going to be kind of the front entrance to the place then what we're going to do is we put three across there and then i'm going to go up and around like this because i'm going to make a one window there bring this up to the same height as the rest of it and we can fill the rest of this in with the birch do exactly the same on the other side so make a two window bring it up to the top and then obviously one two three four five six like that perfect and then uh yeah let's work focus on um the rest of it i might put some glass in actually ready put the glass in here put the glass in here as well and here and then this is what we're going to do for the front entrance so the front entrance we're going to have one here one here like that and one here and one here and then we're going to grab some smooth quartz stairs so quartz get the smooth ones or you could use the normal ones i guess but yeah like that perfect and then um let's see let's do it up one more but this goes over the top of this now and then bring these up so we've kind of got our little doorway there might bring it up one more actually because i kind of want this boathouse to stand out and i don't want the bottom to kind of overpower it too much i want it to be just a huge boathouse basically so we've got the front there that's looking good so far and um, what we can do is grab some grass blocks or dirt blocks if you're in survival and you're going to have to spread the grass up um, I don't think you'll, you'll have to really but I mean depending what you put in here so I'm going to put these across the front here like that so that's in and then maybe I might do this at the front as well so we can either leave it plain or we can do exactly the same as what we've done here we're putting the stairs on like that and then let me see i might do that a little bit later once i've focused on hmm i was going to do this as well but i'm going to wait till i've got the roof all ready now at the back of here we're going to count one two and bring them up to the side and then we've got a pillar here as well I'm going to do exactly the same on this side as well so two lots of birch coming all the way up to the top 
and then this coming all the way up to the top like that. Now I'm undecided if this bit should be bigger and then this bit should be smaller. So maybe I might do that and then it would be, uh, yeah, just cool kind of smaller roofs coming off it. And I think that might, could work basically. But at the same time, hmm, undecided, undecided on this one. Right, so yeah, I'm going to bring this across and fill it in plain so far from that pillar one two three four five bring it all the way up to the top we might have to remove some blocks but uh, this is the only way i can kind of do it so it looks good i can't just plan it and then do it because obviously i'm doing this one a little bit different didn't think i was going to do a tutorial on it but i kind of i'll probably put some windows in there as well going to do the same here so one two one two three four five and then bring this up going to do it the same height i think and uh, it should work hopefully bring this up to the same height as what we've done with the rest of it like that and then we can work on the back so now at the side here we're gonna have one strip going all the way up and across by so we'll count this one one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and if we bring it up like that and then we've got one either side of it like this this one coming up to we need to have it the same height as these so that'd be one two three four five six so bring that one two three four five six and then all the way across and obviously down and then one gap and then that come up to the top one gap at that that come up to the top and there should be a two gap doorway there you can fill these windows in here and i'll wait to do the door this is going to go over the top like this and i'm going to do exactly the same on the other side so we're going to fly around to the side or walk if we're in survival and just copy exactly the same as that so basically going up from the side of it and count in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bringing it up. A pillar either side. But this one, one, two, three, four, five, six, and all the way across. And then up. And then one gap, that up, two gaps, one gap, boom. And then obviously fill this in here. And exactly what we've done on that side, we're basically doing on this side. So the front and back, all the same. Just a nice little boathouse. So one, two, three, four, five, and that pillar as well. So we're bringing this up to the same height. And I was going to speed this bit up, but there's no. I kind of feel like I'm going to lose some people. Um, we're getting lost what to do. So I'm just going to do it like this. So I'll do that side first, then this side. Makes it a lot easier for people one two three four five and then obviously fill it in just as we have done the other side so yeah um i don't know exactly how this is going to look but i kind of got a good idea i kind of got a an idea so i'm going to bring that up like that and then we're going to do two out bring all these up to the top same from this pillar that we've just placed one two and then bring a pillar up same with this one and then exactly the same with the windows so we do the window first and then bring it up so one two three making sure you've got a two window on that this up one two three four five six and then counting this one that's one two three four five six seven and bring it up like that eight nine <laughs> so that's that's the uh, size it should be okay and then three here obviously doing the window first and filling the rest in like that and then over the top and we can start to add some details so what we've done on the other side we placed one one there one one here and a stair on top and then we've got our grass blocks one, two, three, one, two, three, and then using the oak trapdoors. Or just, yeah. So, yeah, we've got that, and um, let's see. 
let's see what we can do with this i think it's time to do the roof and then we can fill in all the bottom details after that but that so far pretty cool it's looking pretty all right so for this we're going to count one two three and then one two three again same here one two three one two three like that and then we're going to bring it out one two three four five and then one two three so it's overhanging by three on each one so same at this one one two three four five and then one two three past it so same with this bring it out by three same at this side one two three and then this one as well so we're going to have an archway going up there an archway coming up on this one archway on that side archway on that side all arching up one two three past that and then this two three okay so there's going to be a bit where i'm going to speed up obviously for certain bits so i'll uh, show you kind of one roof we're just doing it from here the very end one stair under stair under until we reach the top same from this side stair under stair under just basically bringing those up until they meet in the middle as an arch and so that side's going to be the same as that side that's the same as that so this is going to be exactly the same as well arching up and at the top you should have two meeting like that and at the front there you should have a gap in the middle because one's odd number one's an even number so i'm going to speed this process up and i shall come back once i've done it so i'll just do this one here so just keep doing stair under stair under um you guys kind of know what to do i don't know why i have to say, say this bit but yeah and then if you put two stairs together two stairs on top we have got our archway like that and then we can start adding some detail to it i kind of want a tower in the middle so i might actually do that ready so the best way for us to try and figure this out is probably counting one two three from there one two three from that corner so from that corner that corner that corner and that corner one two three one two three okay so maybe we'll bring these two in and these two in this way and um let's see maybe that might be quite a good one but i might bring it in again so bring it into here bring it into here like that and yeah i think that'd be perfect so that'd be yeah hmm should we do it a bit thicker maybe it's actually start from here so i'm going to bring it up all together from that one that one that one and that one and then we can remove the rest those were just kind of placement blocks so we know we are exactly in the middle where we need to be so that's two so far one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen i think we should go up to fifteen for now um and this is so when we're bringing the roofs up we know what to blend in like that and this one up like that so i just kind of want a tower like poking out the top just to make it kind of unique so that roof will fit into there i'll probably bring that tower even more out might remove this underneath so we've got some more space underground but you kind of get the idea so i'm going to speed this process up doing these so they're all like that so yeah okay i have brought those up and uh, yeah on top i've just put a stair under and then a stair facing out like that on those two main front ones like that uh, so across here i'm going to grab some of the pillar quartz and just basically putting it across like that and then what i'm going to do here is um in level with this and in level with this of the doorway we're going to place those and bring them all the way up to the top until we reach there you don't want to go past it because the roof's obviously going to go there so it's going to kind of go like that so one behind like that and then maybe maybe one here that's level with this window so it's all kind of symmetrical so just two there level with that window one two and yeah i'm going to copy and paste two sides so 
once I've done that copy and paste it over there once I've done that side I'll copy and paste it over there so focus on this and then you can repeat it on the other side and uh, yeah it just makes life a little bit more easy I guess All right so once I've done that this is where I'm gonna have these pillars apart so one two like that and one here one one two so that's the point in there and we could have one here as well one one two one one two either side of the the doorway there Um, for here maybe let me just try this first before anybody starts to do some stuff Um, I'll put one here one here and then maybe I could put a pillar like that I'm <laughs> falling and then maybe would this work putting a stair under like that to have then um, some of the trap doors don't worry I'll repeat it for the other side I'm just kind of experimenting here so one like that maybe we could have another window like that something like that I think that'd be pretty cool so yeah I'm gonna do that so two stairs like that and then a stair like that and then a pillar in between and then um, grab our trapdoors, take out one, put trapdoor there, and put our glass in. Um, for this here, I'm going to go one, two. I kind of want to leave it open plan. So I'm going to go like this, and then maybe put a trapdoor over this front bit here. So you kind of just walk out. It's more for the look, really. Um, so yeah and then across here across the top I'm gonna do this with the trap doors in there and then I can bring this front forward so for this might do this might actually put those in there like that and then um, might even be worth if you're wanting to save on resources you can do this as well it'd probably be easier as well like that across like that and then underneath we can if you would choose to do you can then put them underneath like that probably might make for better detail that way as well so yeah something like that that's pretty cool um I wonder if this is worth doing now nah. across here just across that front bit he you're kind of getting into the realms of more too much detail here if you start doing that sort of stuff so probably best not to but you guys can still do it it's fine right so I'm gonna fill this in and then this is how you know how to fill it in just fill it all in making sure you've got like a step going up do you know what I mean a step like that and then you can still put stairs on top of it to complete the roof so same here same here just filling it all in here like that we've got our step and for this one here I might put one across here and then maybe have like a three window or a two window I think a two wind three window might be cooler at the top fill that all in and fill it in like that and then we could get some more of the iron put this across here and then maybe just maybe we could get some more of these so these kind of make more sense then there to there and then put these trap doors on like that and then maybe get some bouche because you know I love the bouche <laughs> I certainly do it just really makes the build come together so yeah right maybe I wonder if it's even worth doing something like that that is pretty awesome plus we're saving resources so yeah I'm gonna do that so got that hiding that bit maybe like that there so when we have like a lantern or something dangling from there it might look cool 
Yes, yes, it looks very, very good. Maybe one there and there as well. Should we put like one in the middle there so we can kind of dangle one from there as well? Maybe that's an option. And across here, if you wanted to add more detail, here's an idea for you. Um, as I say, you can just keep adding to it. It doesn't have to be the way that I do it. You can change it about. Put some stairs there. So it's kind of like grooved wood. And you can bring it down even more. Like that. I'd say that's a pretty epic front entrance. But I might have a, a bigger window. And then you can obviously add whatever flowers you like. I just think maybe some of the purple like that and maybe something like uh, some lilies or something some white flowers blending with that we can put some lilies down here or you can change the colors about it's unnecessary detail but let's have a look so far I think that's a pretty epic boathouse I kind of feel like it would get away with just really plain kind of Maybe a big plain window with, if we start it here and then wrap it round to here, but have like a post there. And then maybe something like a stair in here. Because then it's not too over detailed because the front is extravagant. Uh, you want some kind of normal sort of windows in there I think just to make it work a little bit better and then of course do you think I forgot to add some bush there um, let's see underneath here maybe we could do some hanging maybe we could have like a hanging lantern from here maybe something like that I think would work um, so yeah I'm gonna do exactly the same here so take those out that going across here put the pillar thing there this going across so it's all kind of even and then turning it in like that add the bush and then yeah just a hanging thing here one two lantern uh, fill in the glass Yes. Um, let's see. If I go back. Yes. Yeah, so I'm going to fill it in one side of the roof. And then the other side of the roof. Obviously it will just kind of work better. So. Obviously when I flip it. Um, now for the rest of the roof. I'm going to use some of the. Stone brick stairs. Like this. So this should go round. And fit into this one I'm just gonna do this half and then obviously I can copy and paste what I've done here on the other side and then all we'll have to do is work on one side here and then we've got some stairs coming down and stuff so yeah obviously what I'm doing at that side I'm doing at this side as well it's just the opposite so just bringing that to here and then this will go across like this If I can do it this is going to be a very slow process so I'm going to obviously have to speed a lot of this up but yeah you get the idea so these are all going round and just basically stop once you get to this point because then you're just repeating the same process on the other side so that'll go round there this will fit in with this height you just got to find the right height actually Yeah, that's the right height. So it will go and lock into here. And this will, of course, go into here. So imagine this box has got this. So one, two, three, four. Might as well do this ready. This box is all closed off. So none of your roofs can actually go through this. And it will make it a lot easier for knowing where to stop your roof otherwise yeah so like here as well 
fill that in and yeah so obviously the other side will be like going across like that and going down exactly the same but if I fill this box in ready we know exactly where the roofs are going to stop but obviously when we get to this roof say that that bit's completed and you're the same side as this you want this to come over like this and then this is where we're gonna have to make the box higher so one two three is probably one two three one two three filling it all in for now like this so just three higher and then we know exactly where the bigger roofs gonna fit into now And I'm uh, doing it this way so, you know, people that are building along, it makes it a lot easier to understand. Across the top um, of the big ones, I'm going to use some quartz. So just the one. A strip going down here like this. So it'd be like that, exactly the same on the other side. In fact, it'd probably look a bit better with this. So the slab of the stone brick. I just feel that might actually look better yeah so obviously following that all the way around so that's joining into that doing exactly the same on the other side so that's going across here so obviously this would be here and it should slot into that you're best working from the the small first and keep going round until you reach the top and obviously this as well folding round and then yeah so and then I'm just gonna repeat it on the other side so I will do all that I will world edit the other side as well so what we've done on that side it's gonna be world edited on this side as well and then we can focus on some other stuff so I will come back when once that's all done and then yeah we can work on a, a peak maybe and then do the sides and maybe some stairways to walk up and stuff and some jetties around here to make it look a little bit more legit and yeah so i'll see what i can do i'll come back once i've done that okay i've managed to get that done so on the front here as you can see it's all going round into that it's all going round into that and exactly the same on the other side beautiful right so facing from the front i'm gonna actually build this up now so let's say we take our windows here here it's like two bigger ones here two there and two there so one two three and over maybe a three window there might be good bringing that up one two three one two three up and over so a big two window there and then one two three up and over so we've got a, a three window and uh, yeah and then we can kind of see what it looks like I'm gonna keep flying back so see if it's enough yep I think that should be enough I'm gonna do one more and this is where I'm gonna do kind of a basic roof so following these pattern that we've got already kind of want to keep the top basic Um, yeah I'm gonna maybe get some slab and uh, stone brick slab like this and yeah just curl it round I think and hopefully that should be all right but we might need to have stairs I think I'm gonna use stairs actually for this for the second layer anyway so yeah the second layer of stairs because i kind of feel like it needs to peak a little bit more than it is doing but we can keep that slab across the bottom and that should be perfectly fine and then we can just see how it looks then and hopefully it's all right because uh, we don't want this sort of roof because it is a boathouse you don't want it too detailed because it'll probably just look out of place um but when these all go together it should have a two gap so like this 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 boom like that and it should perfectly go on yeah looking good and then we're gonna get the 
windows and then just fill these in at these side I'm gonna keep it plain what I might do for this one is actually put a place where we can put some flower beds because it is a bigger window so we could maybe get the trap door and some of the grass blocks maybe just for below and uh, yeah just for these two kind of two by whatever windows so wait let me just see what it looks like yeah that's I'm fine with that so yeah select these windows that windows filled in and the same for this one and then we're pretty good we're going strong and yeah do the same for this one as well and underneath if you choose like that and then you can add some flowers while you're up here maybe you could add some red ones either side this time to bring some color to it and then you could actually red and blue seem to go together well like this and then maybe some lanterns or something let's see if this is all right maybe hmm that's not going to fit under that one roof thing but i'm just going to see if this works first like that and then have lanterns kind of maybe on a chain actually that might work yeah i think that looks quite nice so yeah i'm gonna do it like that with the chain and then that and yeah so that all the way around it so wherever you've got those and get your chain and um, we need one there actually as well one there get our chain on each one and then dangle a lantern from it um, so that's good so far I think pretty awesome actually pretty damn awesome maybe for the smaller roof um, it would actually look better for the quartz slab um, you guys can leave it the same but obviously no actually it won't because that, that's a full one isn't it damn so yeah yeah it's just like that it's probably best anyway okay so we've got that now we need to work on stairs and um, maybe this so for this one I could put this across so what I'm doing on this side I'm doing I'm just gonna copy and paste it to the other side um, in line with this and in line with that one that's down below bring those up and exactly the same as what we did with the other one with this underneath because obviously this will probably be a second floor at some point so we could uh, use this and maybe get up into this bit as well so that floor level will be coming across and um, yeah we could kind of keep this a bit more simple I think because everything else in the front entrance is so detailed let's put that in here and maybe see if we could get away with just uh, um, the birch stairs if I can find them like birch stairs as a groove see if we need a window here now I kind of like it like that and then just one one two one one two like that I kind of like it really simple like this and um, maybe I'll just get some bush or something yeah I kind of like it like that so I'm gonna keep it like that and then I'm gonna put one two one two and maybe just the stairs on for this one like that one bush there one bush there maybe and then here maybe what we could do is um, I'm gonna sneeze in a minute it's not good <laughs> maybe two up here and then two up there I'll maybe bring it down like that 
yeah. I just think even that basic sort of look. I kinda like that. That's good. Very good. Um yeah, I'm gonna get some windows here and fill these in. Same with this one, leaving it open plan as we did with these front entrances here and maybe get some trap doors underneath. So you can just kind of walk through it. Wonder if it's worth putting some of this where the bush is. Kind of just works with the bush really, but um, I guess because of I've got better leaves mod, but you guys can mess around with different ideas that you think might be cool. But I think even just that, that sort of simplistic, simplitism something yeah that simplistic sort of look is good we could maybe do you know when we did this somehow get a staircase maybe yeah maybe a staircase going up here that leads into the house I think that would be a really cool idea to do we've got the birch planks there right okay so from the front entrance here, it's just the front entrance, we want to come up to here and maybe turn this into a stair set coming up here. Like this. And then obviously, to get to the other side, you can just walk around anyway. So um, it should work perfectly. Hopefully. Um, so I'm just going to do these stairs up until we reach the point where we can actually get through so I'll have to remove that one like that and then you just got to remove enough to be able to walk through it so is that enough yeah and then just like that and then um, yeah we can work on making that a bit better so people don't fall down but Let's get the stairs underneath here. Well, I want to put the stairs underneath each one so it kind of doesn't look silly. So like that, and then passing through here. Yeah, I really like that. I think that's uh, good. I might actually take another one out of that just so we've got a little bit more room. And then, hmm, let's take it off again and then put this across. And then we can go like this. Maybe to here actually. Like that. And then we can use some of this. Maybe the railings that we've used out here would make sense to do it on the inside and it brings a bit of light as well. And then obviously what we've put on top which is the quartz on each one of those and our trapdoors. Like that. So I'm kind of trying to do the interior for this as well. Um, what you could do here as well. Um, get some bushes up here so it's kind of like kind of a bit more grand. And then you put some stairs there so it just kind of, yeah. Grand staircase down into a boathouse pretty awesome there's a creep in a in a boat but dude you don't have any arms what what Jesus right so yeah what I've done on this side I'm gonna replicate on the other side and then we can focus on um, yeah doing stairways and the jetties round and then maybe a cool bit of interior but I'm gonna plan that maybe a little bit might make a world file so I can just plan it or I might just build it and then show you guys around haven't decided yet but kind of at the back here um, and I feel like I'm just gonna put some bush around here because it's kind of very bare for my liking um, not that high yeah just some bush on there Will it even work doing this? I have no idea. I'm going to try it anyway, though. It's just a 
bush farm. Oh no. Right, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I'll mess around with some ideas. I don't know if that's probably the most perfect idea in the whole world, but you know. Maybe something like this. And then, like this kind of trimming over the front. Just for something a little bit different. You can mess around with different ideas on that. That's probably the least important bit to get stuck on. So, yeah, I'm going to copy and paste this and I will be back and we can focus on some other stuff. Maybe these side bits or something or some stairs coming down uh, like that. But uh, if you're liking it so far, make sure you slap a like on the video. It does help. And yeah, so I'll come back when this is sorted. So yeah. Right, so I have got that all done. Um, forgot what I got done. Um, but yeah, I've done all that and that. Um, I'm thinking maybe I could have maybe something coming down from here. Um, maybe the stairs coming down from here or something. I'm going to experiment. I'm going to bring it up to this point here where we've got these. And then the stairs can go like that. So I'm going to bring it down by... I'll probably repeat the same thing on the other side as well. Just keeping it all symmetrical, you know what I mean? Bring it down to there. So that's how many lots of stairs? One, two, three. Maybe four. Maybe four. Should we do four? Yes. Yes, I'm going to do that. And then from that I want to kind of um, bring this up from the floor about the same height as that and then have it come down here maybe let's we'll see if this works might not but you never know and um, so I kind of feel like maybe we could have the steps going down kind of like that. That would obviously maybe be better there. And have this coming down here, maybe. Let's see. Just want to see what this will look like. And see if it will work out. Maybe. Maybe, baby. Um, like that. And then maybe an extra thing as well. And then we can take out from here, maybe like this, and then bring it down from there. And then we can bring it up this side and maybe take it out of there and there. So up the top here, we've got these kind of things here, like that. And uh, yeah, I'm going to leave that actually there, but on top, maybe put something like that. So it's just experimenting with different ideas that might work. Something like that will do. And I might take that out. Just so it fits in like that. And then bring this down. I might actually remove this bit. So it'll just kind of look a little bit better. But yeah, it's just experimenting with what will work. I'll bring these stairs down. Like this. And then we can obviously put some jetties around this area like that and then do it up this side as well and then close this box off <laughs> i've got a zombie in the way thanks mate gone and i've just sent him on fire that's fine now um yeah might fill it to there and there so obviously that bits maybe something like this and then an extra one for each one. Something like that, maybe. I think that could work. And then, uh, yeah. Um, I kind of like that, but at the same time, I don't. Could I put a bush there or what? 
think I guess that's kind of all right um it's gonna annoy me really but um because really i should have it maybe about here and then have the stairs coming down like this and it'll just work a little bit better so yeah it's just experimenting you can do whatever you like you don't have to do it like this i'm gonna then it makes sense to do that so yeah it just curls around it just sits with me better um, so something like that, that's all right. And then kind of these overhangs, I feel like maybe something like that would work better. And then it's just kind of all in and looks all right. And then maybe something like this on each one, maybe. Or just keep those plain and just leave the top like that yeah I kind of prefer it that way but you could also for this bit could use some bushes around here just for on that bit but let me have a, a look that's a good way to get up and yeah I'm probably gonna bring some of this across here and just level with that for now Fill that all in. So would it be slash slash set five over two maybe? I've got yeah slash slash set five over two. Yes, perfect. And then um, kind of feel like this should come out to one two three four maybe and around like that and yeah just so it looks awesome so i've got that to there and i definitely feel like it could get away with um having something like this to trim around it so it's kind of like a floating jetty of some form just to stop it there yep yeah. and then maybe just maybe bring this out one two three four five six seven eight nine and i might just have the stairs at one side and i think that might work better so that's four so we might as well come out by one two three four so four there and then we can just take this and expand it up here. Smash it to, yeah, something like that. And then I can close it off here. So I'm gonna keep that land there. So it's like part of the land as well. And that goes around here. And maybe stop there so you can kind of get off your boat here if you choose as well. So maybe it's not all symmetrical, but you know, you get the idea. Um, so this side, I decided I'm gonna fill this in here and across here. It might be different at both sides because uh, we've got that symmetricalness, but we still could add something that's a bit different. So one, two, three, four, two, one, two, three, four, five, six something like that and then that over here and maybe just kind of leave that open like that yes and then um, maybe some bushes around here just to this point and then we can grab the half slab over the top Keeping it nice and simple we could put some deck chairs and stuff out there and maybe some boats that are hanging around uh, might bring this out a bit more just for this bit so I can then put some just some bush kind of guiding its way around there and maybe just over the top here I can just 
put it underneath and double it up there like that so yeah I'm happy with that and then um, yeah just for decoration and stuff to add some colors in now is uh, something like this and then get the bush yes yeah, so there's something like that and then maybe get some windows like sliding doors or something that kind of uh, open out like this I think would work so maybe put um, yeah a fence in there so it's kind of like one of those opening shut doors it looks nice for it the back here I feel like we could have some sort of a, a workbench of some form um, probably use the birch but there's some smooth sandstone there or something like that get some of this at the side we can have storage for loads of stuff and like maybe use this space here for some of the chests and stuff um, lantern get some lanterns underneath here as well like there use it for chest space there could probably do some work around there and stuff which might work <laughs> maybe not that there with uh, a pot and a flower in it just for no reason whatsoever just randomly um yes yeah, so got that so boats and stuff you could just stagger some different colored boats and stuff around the area <laughs> zombies got in it there and uh, yeah probably out here you could have like little deck chairs and stuff maybe um, I wonder if this will work Where people lie down just trying to add some color here and stuff like that um two three probably get some string for carpets and stuff um might just do a white one maybe maybe so like white there and then if you get the string underneath And then we can just place them on. You can obviously go into more detail with that sort of stuff. But anyway, yeah. So um, with this, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And just have a two there. I think that's fine. Get our end rods here. And I feel like we could probably get away with um, maybe, let's see if just putting one there actually might be better. I've forgotten what we're going to do. <laughs> Completely forgotten. It's like, it's gone out of my mind. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I was thinking maybe get some podiums here to use as pillared supports here so because it's it's coming out a lot um, it might actually benefit from something like that so yeah just for one of the main supports I suppose it could realistically come down from here it probably make more sense because it's just on the end like that so yeah, something like that, and um, of course this one as well. But this one is going into there. That works out. Let me just have a look back. Yeah, that's pretty awesome. You can have them going down in different areas. Like if you wanted this to go through, have it there and there. You could probably get away with that as well and it would make it look less plain 
and looks like it's, it's got some kind of a support going on same with here as well at the back because it's so far out you probably would have supports and stuff like that and here as well probably the best best bet is just to wear uh, get it all covered in first and see what it looks like and then start digging away at bits that you feel would work like maybe making this doorway a little bit smaller and, uh, something like that sticking to the the bush here because it kind of just makes it a little bit better nobody's going to see this side as much really because it's kind of like how the land is it's kind of overgrown isn't it so uh you can have it like this and maybe have some different windows because it doesn't look as busy to be honest but you add some bush across the floor as well and it's just kind of like yeah this is just kind of where you're getting off your boat nobody's really hanging around in this area anyway so you can keep it nice and simple and uh, if you don't want a doorway you can just have it like that and I thought of uh, a better idea for this um, if we take the sides off here put these on here we can um, I'm actually put it all the way down and then grab a ladder I'm gonna get some iron bars as well because um, we can go like that and typical squid in the way I swear Mojang have um, legit coded everything to get in the way so that's how you get out there so yeah I thought something like that would be probably a better looking idea than what we've got so just taking those two out bringing this over like this and then bringing the block like that um, yeah so something like that so you're pulling up and uh, yeah you put your boats in there and stuff and yeah why is there, is that a turtle is that a slime I've never seen a slime in a boat before that is strange that's a new thing um, right okay I'm getting distracted by slimes here so I need to focus on you just go that way mister I can't even move them it's like legit firm rock solid stuck there right let's get that and that and you're probably asking why don't you put it in peaceful mode it's because when you're building alone sometimes it gets a bit lonely do you know what I mean so when you just got a couple of friends around you know your slime just it's, you know it's a bit of company <laughs> I'm only joking I'm not that sad but I actually am it's fine uh, and then I'm gonna put some little things around here so let's just put some bushes around the place because it just makes it more lived in I think just makes it look far better put some bush around the place bush here just bush everywhere and then across here and yeah it's really starting to take form I'm sure you can add so much more to this but I kind of feel like I shouldn't spend so much time on it I should probably end it here and if it does do well I could then keep going at it but as I say you guys know I'm not doing well at all on YouTube so just just spending this much time as it is is probably very counterproductive for me uh, because I could be focusing on getting out videos for everybody else because um, not everybody's obviously gonna want to build this I'm doing three gaps in here so I'm at least completing this three gaps and then turn that into three and the two just like the other side that one 
but yeah hopefully you got some inspiration from it at the very least and it's something oh and by the way i forgot to mention and um, just so i highlighted the front balcony i put some bush there just running all the way around and i think i'm going to do that i'm probably not going to end it yet i might add some more details in because i'll probably i still feel like building a little bit but yeah if you could slap a like on the video and stuff like that and you do enjoy these sort of things um and you want more of them you're gonna have to help me out here because <laughs> at this rate uh, i don't know the bit the more I, the more i seem to upload it's just really strange the more i upload the worse my videos do um it's just there's no winning there's no winning at this i think once you've been taken off the algorithm it's very very difficult to get back on it and it doesn't matter what you do you could put the literally the best content that someone's ever seen but if uh, nobody's getting their videos then what's the good of that do you know what i mean so uh yeah um, you can add detail i'll just show you a little tiny details i probably would do is because this is plain you'd probably get away with some buttons there just looks nice and trim um so like there 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 and there and uh yeah i kind of like how it is really it's a pretty epic boathouse and what you could do i have got a tutorial on how to build a speedboat um so you could probably get that kind of driving into here so it looks like it's driving in as so you could do something like that um to add to it and uh yeah you can do little things like um instead of these bushes you can then add dirt and stuff just so you can kind of add um some color into the place so like this and um getting some of these it's probably best to just do it there and then leave that there that's bush take that out and then get some big red flowers across that but you can add your own details to it but i think that should be enough for now and uh, if it does do well um i could definitely do a whole lot better elaborate inside and stuff but just in case it doesn't happen, obviously this is going to be the floor level. And it's going to go over to here. And then obviously you can make a staircase going down into there and stuff. But uh, yeah. So a floor level there and then maybe a staircase going down into there. And I could definitely do a load with this but uh yeah i'm gonna leave it for now and uh obviously do it in the next video if i get enough um views and uh, i'm sorry a lot of these videos i'm like i'll do it if i get enough views and i never get enough views so i never do it um you gotta understand like i can't spend this much time on a certain project because i've got other people asking me for different projects so i'm i'm all the time i'm trying to adapt and uh, change my content for the most amount of people to like if you get my if you get what i mean so i don't just want to uh, make content that maybe one or two people are like like the majority the majority wins all of the time you know but i still do try to uh, make content that maybe the majority doesn't like as well on this channel um i'm sure you guys know that but it, it never really pays off to do it but i still try and do it but you can understand i can't do it all the time um every time there is a certain project but something like this like just little things you can change on it it doesn't have to be a certain way say if you don't like that and you want to add more color into it you could start um making like a, a door that's maybe a spruce because that might stand out a bit more and uh just add in little bits of color that you feel would work like in here as well like if you like it's too plain and kind of the same start to um make it your own by adding little colors here and there that'll really bring out the build 
and obviously I can't do that at the beginning because I haven't thought about it yet but I've just thought about it now this was just meant to be kind of my own sort of project kind of building alone I like to build I'm sure you guys kind of um, know that yourself it's sometimes it's just nice to build without the pressure of feeling like you're recording it needs to be a video it needs to be something I'd rather um, have days where I'm just like yeah I'll just build my own thing and just never show anybody but yeah just stuff like that I think if you can change the roof and everything you know um, but yeah something like that makes a makes a difference and uh, I kind of like it but at the same time even just the garage doors by themselves I kind of like now this is you can leave now this is pretty much the end of the video I'm just bambling now so I don't know why you're still watching um, I might just carry on actually whatever at this point it's uh, it's game over for me <laughs> I mean, right, so there I might put, um, do you think that looks all right? Do you guys tell me? Um, so, yeah, I kind of like that. There's not really any other kind of blocks we can use, is there really, that might um, kind of work with this, but doesn't make it kind of... Uh, yeah, that kind of works, but it's not taken away from the build so much. Um, let's see. Hmm. Who thinks we should change the roof? Should we experiment? I mean, it's the end of the video anyway, so yeah, it's, might as well. Right, I'm going to go up here. I'm going to see what the stone brick would look like in a spruce. Um... And if I do decide to like it, I might tell people at the beginning, so wherever you use stone brick, just use spruce instead. That could be an idea. All right, let me try this. You've seen it firsthand. You've seen the magic firsthand happening. Right, okay, here we go. It's the moment of truth. Slash slash set stone, stone brick stairs for Five. No. <laughs> Stone brick stairs for spruce. Stairs. Why is that not working? Oh no, 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 it's replace, isn't it? Replace. Right, here we go. Boom. Okay, <laughs> that's kind of all right, but obviously, because um, of world edit, it messes up. So you have to actually turn them the right way. But obviously, I'd have to change all of that. Um, but let me have a look. It's kind of nice-ish. Will it stand out? You've seen the after process here, pretty much. Um, it's kind of alright, slash slash undo. Meh, kind of like this better. So anyway guys, yeah, I'll catch you in the next video. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. And uh, shall see you later. Make sure you check out my other um, content. Hopefully you get inspired from it. And yeah, peace out.